Hi there, folks. I thought maybe I would give you a little bit of insight as to why I moved to uh, to Texas. Um, I wanted to to talk about uh, my reasoning behind it because I've had a couple people in my real life that have asked me, not real life, but in regular day to day, uh, has asked me why I moved, and sometimes I wonder why. Um, myself, but my reasoning was because I've got pretty nasty arthritis in um, basically all of my joints, and um, so uh, what makes me feel better is heat and humidity, uh, so Texas was an option. Um, I like the proximity to the ocean. I've got a um, couple hours drive, maybe two hours drive before I meet the uh, Gulf, so that's nice. Um, I just, I absolutely adore the ocean. Uh, it's another reason why I like Puerto Rico so much is because of the, how beautiful the ocean is there. Um, the cost of living here is much better than in Colorado was. Um, in fact, Colorado is 13.8% more expensive than, than it is here. Uh, for instance, gas, I researched it and today gas was 289 a gallon versus the 245 a gallon here which works out to about 8.50, between 8.4 and 8.5 is the difference anyway. Um, trying to math it out. Um, the, lo the location I have now, um, I'm near a lake, so I get to be by a body of water. Um, I bought this house like two years ago, maybe three years ago now, um, and I, uh, um, bought it for a winter house, and, um, it turns out that now it's my full-time house. Uh... So there's that. And then, lastly, I like that there's no state taxes here. Um, it's one less thing to worry about come tax time. Just a little bit less to worry about. Um, so that was another, another reason why I, I chose here versus other places. Um, I'm just opening a couple of things with you on camera. open. So that's, that's why I moved. Um, and I've gotten, well, why did you move if you didn't have a job? I had a promise of a job and that didn't come through, um, as promised. So I was kind of, I, I had moved from Reese responsibly um, with that uh, with that promise in mind and then um, that didn't work out so I uh, could fall back on the fact that I, I was part-time at uh, Lowe's and uh, they said yeah they would give me 35 or 40 hours 35 or 40 hours a week and um, that didn't work out. Uh, so that's why I'm in the position I am now. Uh, I had been, ma been made promises and uh, they didn't come through. So I bought myself a photo, um, photo printer so that I can work on my scrapbooking. And that's what this is. That's what that box was too. It was more of the the ink and the uh, uh, paper for it. So there's that. I had ordered um, 
uh, stencils for card making and I found one that specifically said it was for card making and then I started to open up the package and I noticed it felt like the uh, the stencil in there was quite big and remember card making the cards are four by six and this is a 10 by 15 that's quite large for a card um, but at least it comes with two other sizes uh, so I can still use it and I can still use it as it is to just have very large images um, so that's my reasons for moving and that's my quick little unboxing as, as I was talking so we shall uh, talk to you later. I should be having a uh, deliver or a uh, box coming from Stampin' Up. I've got two boxes. One's a paper pumpkin, and so maybe I'll do something with that for you. Well, not you know what I mean. I'll do something with that, uh, and I will. Um, Uh, share the the box of paper uh, the box of stuff from Stampin' Up because it's quite a large large uh, package so I'll share that unbox that with you so anyway uh, after that we'll talk to you later bye.